Hello everyone, you've joined us on Sunday morning, the 14th of January, here to deliver all your daily updates. I'm Hisham. And I'm Zena. And this is Good Morning ACS. High school subject fair is uh, 22nd of January. This helps grade 10s understand the course offerings and choices for grades 11 and 12. Battle of the Bands will be 23rd of January at International School of London Guitar. Our MHS band will be performing, so come see them and support them as they compete against other schools. Lower School Student Voice Club. Um, all right, thank you for joining us uh, with daily updates. Uh, uh, up next is uh, upcoming sports. It is a, it is a quite, quite a busy week in sports this week. Here is a look at all the events that are coming up this week. The afternoon. This afternoon, our JV girls basketball team will compete against Guitar Academy at 3.30 to 4 o'clock at Osage Recreation Center. Come support them uh, later. Additional, additionally, the JV girls soccer at the ASD match will happen at ASD at 4 to 4.30 p.m. this afternoon. This Tuesday, the Varsity Girls Soccer Tournament versus ASD will take place at ASD Pitch from 2.30 to 3 p.m. That was a look at ACS Dolphins' upcoming sports events. With Amir, up next is World News. Hello everyone, this is World News with Hisha. Steep slopes on Mars reveal the structure of buried ice on the red planet. Researchers have found eight sites where thick deposits of ice beneath Mars' surface are exposed in faces of eroding slopes. The ice was likely deposited as snow long ago. We may be able to see mountains and valleys at distant, uh, on distant worlds. Moya McTeer at Columbia University in New York presented her research into the embryonic field of ex- Wow, uh, okay, exotopography, I guess, on January 11th at a meeting of the American Astronomical Society. She says that by analyzing the dip in stars' light as a planet passes in front of it, we might be able to discern actual det details about the planet's landscape. How flowering planets conquered the world. Hundreds of millions of years ago, the Earth was dominated by ferns and conifers. Then, about 150 million years ago, the first flowering plants appeared on the sea. That they then compared genome size with anatomical features such as the abundance of pores on leaves. This provides strong evidence, they say, that the success and rapid spread of flowering plants around the world is down to genome downsizing. And thus, were the latest headlines in world news. Up next is weekly weather. Welcome to the week's forecast. The current temperature is 12 degrees Celsius. The high of today is 26 degrees and the low is 12. The weather for the rest of the week is expected to be chilly. This temperature trend will, stay generally, will generally stay the same for the rest of the week and the sun will be out and bright every day. That was weather with myself, Amira. And Zana. And up next is where in the world was food salad. It's time for Where in the World with our fabulous fruit salad team. Last week, fruit salad visited Paris. Can you guess where in the world they are this week? Don't forget to email your answers to us before Wednesday to goodmorningacs at gmail.com. Good luck. Thank you for watching Good Morning ACS and have a happy Sunday.